Hey YouTube, how's it going? Doofanatic95 here, and I am joined by the lovely Book Nerd Knowledge, and we are here to talk about Entry 81. Yes. So, recap from last entry, Jay got shot. Not in the butt talks. Forrest Gump reference. Yeah, never mind. Anyway, uh, yeah, he got shot, and Tim is uh, the protagonist now. He's uh, doing all the stuff on the Marble Hornets account. And he decided to upload some footage. So here's where the spoilers begin. But if you've watched the other entries, there's really not too many spoilers here. Yeah, uh, we got 14 minutes of Tim walking around with the chest cam. <laughs> yep. Yeah, completely useless. So much suspense building, you know, all, all the main players here and everything. Got this new location, all this good stuff happening. And then we get entry 81. And... There's really nothing going on. Yeah. Essentially, we see Tim arriving at the old college campus. Uh, he's <coughs> looking for a, a way to just kind of explore the campus. And he makes up some bogus excuse about him working with Alex to finish the film when he's questioned by a man on the campus. Uh, he says he's looking for equipment from their days of filming the movie. And he suggests that he go into Benedict Hall. Irony, irony, yeah. But, uh, so yeah, we met a new character, and, uh, there was a maintenance man named Jacob that was absent. Was he taken? Probably not. But, I mean, it's, it's, it's just fun, you know. Anyway, he, uh, explores, uh, a, uh, building to basically find a backdoor entrance into it, uh, through the sewers, and that's what he was doing during Entry 79 when Jay was following him. He uh, basically breaks open the manhole, goes in, he hides from Hoodie, who's down in there. He finds a way into Benedict Hall, sees Alex, and runs out of the building. And that is when Jay enters the building, and while that happens, Tim is in his car, he blacks out, and his pills are stolen. So that was the entire entry. Nothing of much significance. I was able to dig one thing out of it, though. And that is, Hoodie was not uh, Alex in disguise, uh, which I thought maybe was the case, like Alex set up a trap for them. I'm not saying Hoodie and Alex are the same person, I'm just saying that maybe he was disguised, but that has been thrown out by this entry, which I'm sort of glad they've done that, you know, that's the one useful thing that was in this entry. What do you think? I definitely agree. We definitely didn't want Alex to be disguised as Hoodie, and... It would just be sad if he was, and finally we know that for sure. It's definitely not happening. So, so yeah, little substance in the century, so it's really disappointing. Uh, like like she said, you know, we had so much suspense, and this was sort of just a letdown entry, which I know has to happen. And a lot of people find entries to be full of filler and just nothingness, and I've noticed that before, but nothing on this magnitude. I mean, at least they sort of bridged the gap between entries. This did offer a unique perspective on the events of the past two entries, but it didn't offer quite enough. Like, maybe if Tim had made some discoveries that Jay hadn't made, maybe the entry would have been worth it. But in the long run, this entry just doesn't feel like it fits. I mean, there's, like, no good connection between the events that happened with Jay I mean, you do hear the gunshot in the background in the chair, but otherwise, nothing really happens like monumental at all. It's just kind of a little side story that means nothing. Yeah, I'm, it's basically recap. I think it could have been covered in like a short clip in a future entry. Perhaps put together like two or three minutes of the events of this entry to basically highlight Tim's experiences while he was on this college campus and then go from there. But I, I just don't know what Tim's going to do because he, he says he wants to pick up where Jay left off, but, I mean, what's he going to do? Just go run back into Benedict Hall? I mean, Alex could have left there by now, now that the, uh, the trap has been sprung. Yeah, what, what is Tim going to do? I mean, it just seems like there's a lot of pieces and he does, he's not going to really put them together, I don't think. I mean... Although he does have better detective skills than Jay, I mean, we don't even know where Alex is. I mean, 
Is Hoodie even still wandering around? So. Well, I guess he's just got to either find Alex somehow and eliminate him, or find out who Hoodie is and what he's up to. Those are his two options as far as I see it, but you know, maybe they'll write something clever in. They've done that before. I mean, I've seen them write themselves into a hole, it seems, and then they have a new direction and they're going places with it, so I think they can do it, but this entry overall was just lacking, and that's something against their creative process. Maybe they felt this entry was necessary somehow, but I just don't see it. I don't see it either. Maybe there's something that we're not seeing, which I don't, you know, I don't really think so. But, I mean, at least we have something to look forward to, because it's going to be better than this. I mean, it has to be better than this, I hope. True. The next entry. And, you know, it just occurred to me, maybe this is like Tim longing for a To The Arc video, like uh, some sort of guidance on how he should proceed. I mean, that's quite possible. Because he, he's really kind of lost. So, maybe he's just kind of reaching out. But, I mean, I, I don't know. He's smarter than Jay, but not that smart. <laughs> yeah. Well, any final thoughts you'd like to share? Bad entry. <laughs> um, I mean, may, maybe it will be an important perspective later on, but I just don't see how it was really that productive. But. Yeah. So I guess we'll save final judgment till the end of the series, but overall, just felt kind of wasteful, and that's just how it is. So I think that's it. Where can the good people find you? Uh, Book Nerd Knowledge. Yeah. Um, hit that up on YouTube. Hit that stuff. Yeah. Hit link that will, subscribe. Yeah. Link will be in the description, and you can find me on this channel, of course. And the next review will be posted on her channel. So be sure to check that out. And check out the previous reviews. See all that good stuff. Uh, looking forward to, to uh, the, the next to the arc and the next entry, whatever they put out. And uh, we will see you next time.